Yeah, I love this, Erwin, because of the fact that the Greek actually, when Jesus says you must be born again, actually means you must be born from above. Right. OK, God's got to do the changing in your life. And Jesus called that being born again. And when people that have had this experience, I remember the, the day that I invited Christ to come into my life. And, you know, some people talk about the experience of falling in love with a girl or a guy, and it was a real moment, okay? But for me, it was a moment where all of a sudden I realized I know God personally. And I just couldn't, I couldn't fathom it. And I couldn't stop from telling people, I know God. It's something that people should have. And you know, that's the problem with Nicodemus. He was so overloaded with rules, but he had no reality. He had lots of rules to live by, but he had no relationship. John, there are people listening to us today who don't understand that you can know God personally once you are born again and the Holy Spirit of God changes your desires. Yes. Now, when a person is converted, it is instantaneous. But that doesn't mean that there aren't all kinds of incremental issues which eventually lead him to conversion. And uh, that certainly is true. I yeah. could give examples of that. And there are people who are listening today who have had the gospel shared with them in different ways, and God has brought them to this moment to see this program for this moment in their lives that they may accept Christ as Savior. And once that happens, it is an instantaneous change. Yeah. Folks, look, you might have, like Erwin and I, we went to church all of our life, but we weren't born again. We uh, probably sang in the choir. I went to the Christian Boys Club. I played with all my Christian friends. I read the Bible with our family. I still wasn't born again. And you can be a church member, a choir member, an usher. You can do good works. You can take care of the poor. You can give money in the offering plate and you still aren't born again. This is something, it's a gift that only God gives and it's a gift that you desperately need.